Hello there, folks. I'm here at the National Zoo, and uh, you can see the bald cypress trees are just starting to get their uh, leaves back. These are one of the few deciduous conifers out there, and uh, native within an hour of DC, or uh, about an hour away from DC. And uh, they're naturalized everywhere here, so really, really cool species. And uh, you know, they're planted absolutely everywhere. And a very appropriate setting for them here because this is the alligator section, and it's actually warm enough out now that the alligators are uh, hey. oh, are out. Hey, Look at this. Oh. Look at hey, that. The alligator right here. Crazy. So these things are uh, native to the southeast, as are bald cypress, and their, their ranges actually are pretty similar. You know, obviously bald cypress are native, you know, just to some areas a lot further north, but but uh, generally the range across the south is pretty similar and uh, really really cool. Yeah. Look at the, uh, the knee on the bald cypress tree. You can see that's what happens when they're growing in, in standing water or even just in moist conditions. They have these huge roots that are helped to stabilize them, in, like storms and stuff. Really, really cool trees, and uh, again, you'll see um, the alligators inhabiting a lot of these swamps um, in areas where the bald cypresses grow. And uh, alligators are native all the way up to Virginia. Some say into Virginia, and up to like almost to Tennessee. I think there have been sightings in Tennessee, into Arkansas, uh, Oklahoma, right where Sable Miner is native. So they've actually got a pretty similar range to Sable Miner. Very similar, in fact. So uh, very, very cool. 